I'm Nicole Griffin bringing you the latest WRTV headlines from the gas pump to the grocery store. Hoosiers are feeling the impact of rising prices. It begs the question, what is being done to help ease the money crunch? We caught up with Governor Holcomb on Wednesday. We asked him if there are any plans to tap into the state's six billion dollar reserve. Reserve one day at one balance is not the same the next year. And the six billion dollar question is, When's the recession come, if? And also, how is this national inflation impacting the state of Indiana? The governor did say he has made a little progress on potential relief and said he has an idea to provide some, but he wouldn't expand as to what that plan was or when Hoosiers might see relief. Starting Friday, Hoosiers will join people across the country to push for change to put an end to gun violence. It's part of the Wear Orange campaign. It started in 2015, not long after a Chicago teenager named Hydea Pendleton was shot and killed. Her friends honored her by wearing orange. Here in Indianapolis, siblings changing and restoring society, also known as SCARS, and Moms Demand Action will host events throughout the weekend as a way to honor, educate, and push for change. This as Indianapolis comes off a record-breaking year for homicides. Just because one day we see that we didn't have a shooting here in the state of Indianapolis, that doesn't mean our work is done. It's a constant, um, um, it's a revolving door. We just got to keep going, keep pushing, and get things going in the, uh, the right direction. Friday marks National Gun Violence Awareness Day. Several events around central Indiana are planned, including in Indianapolis and Fishers.